Chris Pratt wants you to be his dad. Dave Bautista <laughs> fanboys you. You've walked into a serious love fest. I never know this stuff, but it's always fun to find it out. It's, I mean, it's, you know, it's always fun to find it out, period. James Gunn, this is his baby. This is, he, he, he creates this. He knows what he wants. He's completely on top of it. He's got all the layers that are fun. And he's created an incredibly dense movie. I thought he did a spectacular job with balancing all the relationships and growing all the relationships. The relationship between Peter and his father was really important and I thought it was handled extremely well by him in terms of what's relatable. Does anybody have any tape out there? I want to put some tape over the death button. Nobody has any tape. Not a single person has tape. You have an atomic bomb in your bag. If anybody's going to have tape, it's you. Well, for you, too, I know that um, Jonathan Schwartz, one of the producers, said that you were very into exploring the mythology of the world. What's most helpful when you're doing that? Did you go back to the comics? Was it talking with James? Was talking it... with James. My job is to try to create entertaining ways of telling the story James wanted, wants to tell through a character. Yeah. Just my character and what his involvement is. Mm -hmm. But in order to do that, I need to know what James wants from that character and what he doesn't want from that character. Mm. For me, uh, that's what I feed off of to be able to sort of try to take a character that has almost no perimeters. Yeah. That's, I've never played a character that has no perimeters. But if you've created your own existence and you go to Earth and you've decided that I'm going to look like Kurt Russell, that's what I'm going to do. <laughs> and it's like, that's a strange choice. Okay. <laughs> years I've found you. And who the hell are you? I'm your dad, Peter.